Do you have any problems with turning of exotic materials, such as heat-resistant alloys? For example, due to low efficiency, productivity cannot be increased. The tool cost is high because of short tool life. Sudden breakage on tool damages workpiece. Various problems might happen in turning of exotic material. This is Tabayashi from Sumitomo Electric. Sumitomo's coated grade AC5000S series for exotic material turning solves these various problems. AC5000S series are two grades of newly developed coatings and carbide substrate, covering a range from continuous machining to interrupt machining. This AC5015S is our first recommendation. AC5015S has a good balance between wear resistance and toughness. Because new coatings have excellent oxidation resistance, even aged Inconel 718, which tends to increase cutting edge temperatures, can be processed at high speed and high efficiency conditions of 70 meters per minute. In addition, because AC5000S coatings are thick and have excellent crater wear resistance, it shows twice the tool life compared with conventional grades. AC5025S has excellent toughness corresponding to interrupt machining of exotic materials. AC5000's carbide substrate greatly improves toughness while maintaining hardness. This greatly reduces notch chipping, unique to exotic material machining. In addition, sudden chipping can be suppressed, thus improving machining stability. This section describes the features of AC5000S coatings. There are three features. The first is resistance to oxidation, especially in cases when the cutting edge temperature tends to be high. Such as machining exotic materials, the coating is oxidized and transformed into a brittle layer. Resistance to oxidation is an important feature to inhibit this transformation. Upon conducting oxidation resistance tests at high temperature simulating cutting, the aluminum titanium silicon nitride, newly adopted in AC5000S, has a thickness of brittle oxide layer that is less than half of the conventional one, showing excellent oxidation resistance. The second is coating thickness. In order to improve wear resistance, the coating is approximately twice as thick as the conventional coating. Generally, a thick coating debases the quality of the cutting edges, but Sumitomo's proprietary coating technology achieves both coating thickness and sharpness of cutting edges. The third feature is the reactivity with the workpiece. This is the cutting edge after machining heat-resistant alloy. In heat-resistant alloy machining, adhesion is likely to occur on the rake face like in the example shown. Let's look at the cross section of the cutting edge where the adhesion occurred. Inconel and other heat resistant alloys contain a large number of chromium in order to improve heat resistance. And conventional products and general coatings also contain chromium to increase oxidation resistance. If the cutting edge temperature increases during machining, Chromium will diffuse mutually between adhesion and coating, and the adhesion will adhere firmly to the coating. And because both the coating and adhesion falls off together from the cutting edge, the conventional coating was severely damaged. This was one of the causes of short tool life in exotic materials machining. On the other hand, since AC5000S coating does not contain chromium at all, mutual diffusion does not occur. Therefore, the coating will not be damaged when adhesion falls off, and it will be able to exhibit excellent wear resistance inherent in thick coatings. 
The three features described so far have greatly improved wear resistance in AC5000S. Here is a photograph of the cutting edge of the machining in Cornell 718. Parts that appear white indicate that the coating is worn and a carbide substrate is exposed. In conventional grades, the carbide substrate is largely exposed, whereas in the same amount of machine time, AC5000S has such a small exposure and shows outstanding crater wear resistance. These features increase efficiency and extend tool life in high-speed machining and also shows excellent wear resistance even under general conditions. Next, I will explain the carbide substrate. AC5000S new substrate was developed by reviewing not only the coating but also the carbide substrate from the raw materials. Since notch chipping and sudden breakage peculiar to exotic material machining occurs in this carbide substrate, it is necessary to improve the fracture toughness of the substrate. AC5000S has developed innovative raw materials and manufacturing processes to increase the uniformity of the alloy structure. By reducing the fracture origin thanks to uniformity in the structure, the fracture toughness is improved by 20% while maintaining hardness. The newly developed tough carbide substrate contributes to tool life and machining stability. In summary, AC5000S is able to eliminate the troubles of exotic material machining by its newly developed coating and carbide substrate. AC5000S will improve machining efficiency of exotic materials from roughing to finishing. Finally, specific components and workpieces recommended for AC5000S are shown. In the fields of aerospace, oil and gas, we include Inconel, Westploy, Hesteloy, Stellite for engine and valve parts. In the automotive field, heat-resistant stainless steel for turbochargers and heat-resistant steel for engine valves and mnemonics which has been increasing in the recent years. In the medical field, titanium alloys, medical stainless steel and cobalt chromium alloys for artificial joints and implants. Furthermore, because AC5000S is superior in wear resistance and toughness, it is widely used for various materials not limiting to exotic materials. How was the introduction of our AC5000S series? AC5000S offers a wide range of products from large size inserts for rough machining to ground small size inserts suitable for small lathes. Please try our AC5000S for exotic materials turning operations. If you need assistance with any application, Please contact Sumitomo. Thank you very much.